Hey, Woodside family, Pastor Chris here, and I am so fired up to be with you today. You know, once a month, we set aside time to share with you the mission of our Woodside Vision Foundation and how it serves our church in helping us to reach above and beyond our current operations, campuses, and global partners. Today, I wanna to talk to you about one of the most exciting funds within our Woodside Vision Foundation. It's our Campus Accelerator Fund. Now, what this fund does is allow us to make major investment into our campuses. Through our current campuses, this means uh, major renovations or expanding our current facilities, or it could also mean launching new campuses. Today, I'm pretty excited to be joined by uh, the pastor of our newest campus, Woodside Down River, Pastor James DeFord. Pastor James, thanks for joining me. Oh, thanks for having me. I'm excited to be here. Man, this is a long time coming. Right. We're so excited that you guys are on the precipice of your grand opening this fall down river. But talk a little bit for our church family about uh, the history of Legacy uh, Church, as well as uh, what caused you guys to want to be a part of the Woodside family? Sure. So they've been serving the Riverview community since 1963. Wow. Um, my wife Megan and my daughter Annabelle and I, we just started there a year ago, just a little over a year ago. And we saw their heart for not only the Lord Jesus, uh, that's, that's evident the moment you walk in the door. They love the Word of God. They're very faithful to that. They love one another very well, very deeply. And they love the community around them. Uh, we're rebuilding our relationship with the school right now. Um, obviously, COVID took a hit on that. Um, we're reaching out to the local police department. Uh, we have a real passion to get back out in this community now that all these restrictions are gone and just reconnect with everybody. So you can, you're going to see their heart just come right out very soon. So. Yeah, I love that. You know, we started talking with the team over at Legacy uh, over a year before COVID started. Yeah. And so this has been a long time coming, yeah. but what we saw then was this deep commitment to reach the families of the communities downriver with the gospel of Jesus Christ. Yeah. And we couldn't be more fired up about this partnership. So as you think about being now a part of the Woodside family, Woodside Downriver, how can the Woodside family really rally around and partner with you to reach Downriver? Above all, uh, your prayers are coveted, of course, and we appreciate that and we get a lot of feedback on we're praying for you, we're praying for you, it means the world to us. Um, also, if you have any friends or family in the Downriver area, um, just let them know we're there. Um, let them know we'd, we'd be overjoyed to meet them, to welcome them, and to invest into their lives any way we can. Yeah, I love this. Friends, it is an opportunity for us to invest and invite. We know people that are down there in the Down River area that need Jesus, friends and family that are looking for a great church. So why don't you invite them to come and worship? Pastor James, uh, Megan, the church family there would love to receive them. Also, you should know that we invest about $250,000 on average to launch a new campus, to keep a lighthouse open in the community. So I'm asking for you to prayerfully consider investing in our Campus Accelerator Fund. Now, if you're in person, you can do so by scanning the QR code on the bulletin insert that you received today. If you're watching us online, just simply go to our website and you'll find out more there. But your investment will allow us to help to expand the current ministries of our campuses throughout Woodside, but also help us to launch new campuses for the glory of God. Please be in prayer for us for our Downriver campus, for Pastor James and the church family there, as we endeavor to help people to belong to Christ, to grow in Christ and to reach the world for Christ. And remember Woodside that the best is yet to come.